One of my biggest tests as a new leader, there was a coup. Let me tell you the story. I was a brand new manager, and I had an agent that wanted me to help them secure a listing. Now, this agent was a friend of mine, and this is where the problem begins. So my agent sets up an appointment. I go over with the agent to try to get the listing. We get the listing, and I'm thinking everything's great. It just so happens that the following day I was heading off on a vacation. And while I'm down there, I get a call from two agents that, you know, respected me and really cared about me. And they said, Peter, there's a coup starting. And I said, what do you mean? There's two agents that followed you over to that listing appointment and think you're giving favoritism to one of the agents because you're a friend. I said, you have to be kidding. And they said, no. In fact, they've called for a meeting on the top floor tonight. And I'm down in Cabo, Mexico. You can imagine how much fun I was having on my trip at this point. I flew back early. I come back to the office really nervous about what's going on. And I found out, and I was really happy to hear, that not many agents went. Most of them didn't think this was real. So I met with the two agents that organized this coup. And I had them come to my office. And I said, uh, so what happened? What do you think? And they said, well, Peter, we think you're favoring this agent, and blah, 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 blah. And I said, well, I'm going to make a recommendation to you. If you ever feel this way about somebody again, talk to them personally. Don't go around behind their back creating issues. Because you did this, I can't keep you in the office any longer. There's boxes up at your desk. Pack up. You're fired. The next day, I called an emergency meeting at the office because if the agents felt that I was really being favoritism or showing favorites to other agents, I don't think I should work there. So I called an emergency office meeting, and I said, hey, everybody, this is what happened. I'll tell you right now, I love working here. I love all of you. But if you feel that I'm inappropriate for this job or that I'm showing favoritism or anything, tell me now, and I'll pack up my bags, and I'll leave. And I was greeted with applause. And everybody said that they didn't believe these two people and that they wanted me to stay as their manager. That was my first test. It was pretty amazing. I was scared to death, but it all worked out.